We're kicking off in three, two, one, go. Autonomous underway, several powerhouse teams on the field. Jack and the Bot is one of them, three for three with their preload power cells. Their alliance partners also lined up and removing themselves from the initiation line for 10 points added to that score. Jack and the Bot goes back and another set of power cells delivered through the port for the Red Alliance. They have activated stage one of their shield generator in this match already. Big Red Alliance lead, but the Blue Alliance also an incredible autonomous period. They come out with more than 30 points. And for the Blue Alliance, Stealth Robotics working on collecting power cells and lifting them on up into the outer port for the Blue Alliance, adding two points to their score with every power cell that passes through. The Red Alliance has scored five additional power cells since they were able to activate Stage 1 of their Shield Generator. Blue Shield Generator now online, Stage 1 completed as well. Mostly due to the work of Stealth Robotics in Blue Bumpers. They have sent their Alliance partners downfield, 7461 Sushi Squad and Spartronics. Both of them sticking tight to the Red Alliance offense on the field. But Jack in the Bot wide open. Five more power cells for the Red Alliance. Just six until the opportunity for control arises for Red. Over one minute remaining. Already a high score for both alliances. 98 for the Red Alliance. 51 for the Blue Alliance. Power cells being dropped on in by human players behind the loading zone in the Blue Alliance side of the field, right in front of the Blue Alliance driver's station. We see Jack and the Bot lining on up. They hit four for five. And it looks like that is enough to bring Sage 2 to capacity for the Blue Alliance, Red Alliance rather. The Red Alliance control is now unlocked. Jack and the Bot though, they forego that option on the control panel, make their way to the loading zone. They are gonna score as many power cells as they can, even though they do not contribute to increased operation of their shield generator. 18 seconds remaining in the match. Blue Alliance has beat Red, though, to the hang. This could swing the match in favor of the Red Alliance. First off the ground is going to be the Blue Alliance Smartronics, followed by Stealth Robotics. Both are up, but both fall as part of one of those hooks shatters in the final moments of qualification match number 50. The Red Alliance. Both alliances perform wonderfully, but 169 will seal the deal for the Red Alliance compared to 81 for the Blue Alliance. Of note, despite the win, Jack and the Bot does fall into second place.